Hey Google, what noise does a cat make? This is what cats sound like. Have you ever thought to yourself, how does Google find all these websites and how does it know what's relevant? Well, let's start by getting a scope of the size of the internet and how many websites there are. According to internetworldstats.com, there are over 1.7 billion websites as of January 2020, and that's just domains. Google has recently stated that there are over 130 trillion unique pages on the internet, and that number is growing constantly. So how do search engines go through all of that data? Well, it all comes back to algorithms, and there are three major functions of these algorithms, crawling, indexing, and ranking. First off, an engine crawls through the internet, finding new and updated content using programs known as crawlers or spider bots that scour their way across the internet. After the bots make their way through each site on each web page, they add what they found to an index. In the case of Google, they get added to what's known as Google Caffeine. Google says that every second caffeine processes hundreds of thousands of pages, and that's all at the same time. Also, all of this data adds up to 100 million gigabytes of storage in one database, and it adds new information at rates of hundreds of thousands of gigabytes every day. All of this data is then ranked on a number of different things. There's credibility, there's usefulness, there's relativity to a search topic, and keeping up with Google, they use a ranking algorithm known as PageRank, which is not only a common sense type name, but it's also named after the Google co-founder Larry Page. PageRank works by counting the number and quality of links to a page to determine a rough estimate of how important the website is. The underlying assumption is that more important websites are likely to receive more links from other websites. So there you have it. Relevance on the internet is determined by how many people are talking about you, and that's just how fame works in the real world, I guess. Now, all of my site sources will be in the description below, and if you want to read into any of this yourself. If you have any extra questions or you wanted to make a comment, leave it down below. If you like this video, like the video, but otherwise, I'm Waylon, and this is Other PCs.